Something incredible is happening in our atmosphere right now. And what I'm about to share will completely change how you view this winter. Three massive Arctic invasions are lined up like dominoes, ready to unleash a winter transformation that will reach every corner of America. We're not talking about your typical January cold snap. This is a complete atmospheric revolution that's about to rewrite the weather map. Starting today, the first Arctic assault is already building momentum across the Great Lakes, preparing to sweep down into regions that haven't seen meaningful snow all season. But here's what makes this absolutely fascinating. Multiple Alberta clippers are about to deliver snow to areas from the Midwest all the way down to the Tennessee Valley. And if you think that sounds impressive, wait until you hear about the second Arctic blast that's going to make the first one look like child's play. Before we dive deeper, I want you to drop your city in the comments right now, because what's coming will affect different regions in dramatically different ways. This weekend brings Arctic air so intense it could push snow as far south as Georgia and Alabama, places that rarely see flakes flying. From Minneapolis to Miami, from Seattle to Savannah, virtually no American will escape the reach of these cascading weather systems. Now here's where this story takes a turn that even professional meteorologists are calling remarkable. The temperature swings we're tracking are so dramatic they're creating perfect conditions for weather phenomena that happen maybe once a decade. I'm talking about freeze watches stretching all the way down to central Florida. That's how powerful this Arctic machinery has become. As we witness these incredible atmospheric forces aligning, I can't help but marvel at the divine precision in these natural patterns that affect millions of lives. It reminds us how small we are compared to the magnificent power that orchestrates these weather systems across our continent. Let me paint you a picture of exactly what's unfolding. Starting with the Great Lakes region, where lake effect snow machines are about to go into overdrive. Chicago residents, bundle up because this clipper system hits you with full force tonight into tomorrow. We're talking rapid accumulation and whiteout conditions. Detroit, Grand Rapids, and Milwaukee, clear your schedules because snowfall rates could reach two to three inches per hour in the most intense bands. But wait! There's something absolutely incredible happening further south that's capturing meteorologist attention nationwide. Nashville, Memphis, and Louisville are positioned right on the edge of winter weather potential as Gulf moisture clashes with Arctic air. Indianapolis and Columbus could see their first significant snowfall of the season as this system tracks through the Ohio Valley. Pittsburgh and Cleveland, you're in the sweet spot for accumulating snow as cold air pours in behind this advancing weather front. Now here's what's absolutely mind-blowing about the second Arctic invasion that arrives this weekend. This isn't just another cold front. It's a supercharged Arctic Express that's going to reshape temperature maps from Canada to the Gulf Coast. Buffalo, Syracuse, and Rochester prepare for lake effect snow that could measure in feet rather than inches as Arctic air screams across Lake Erie and Lake Ontario. And here's where this gets really interesting for our friends in the southeast. Atlanta, Birmingham, and Charlotte need to pay close attention. The collision between stubborn gulf moisture and incoming Arctic air could create snow possibilities where they're least expected. Raleigh, Greensboro, and Asheville are positioned perfectly for potential winter weather as this Arctic air mass pushes further south than normal. Jacksonville, Tallahassee, and even northern Orlando could experience their coldest temperatures in years as this Arctic freight train barrels through. Let me ask you this. What's the weather situation looking like where you're watching from right now? Share your current conditions in the comments because I personally respond to weather reports from viewers across the country. Now, let's talk about what makes this pattern so fascinating from a meteorological perspective. We're dealing with not one, not two, but potentially three separate Arctic air masses arriving in rapid succession over the next week. Denver and Colorado Springs, you're the launching pad for these systems as they pick up moisture and intensity crossing the Rockies. Kansas City and Oklahoma City, you'll experience the temperature whiplash firsthand as these competing air masses battle for territory. Dallas and Houston residents might be wondering how this affects you. Well, even Texas isn't immune to this Arctic invasion's reach. Here's what separates this event from typical winter weather. The sheer geographic scope, 
and persistence of these Arctic air masses. New York City, Philadelphia, and Boston are all in line for potential snow events as these systems track up the eastern seaboard. Washington, D.C. and Baltimore could see their most significant winter weather in years if these storm tracks align perfectly. But here's the really fascinating part about the extended forecast pattern we're seeing develop. This isn't a brief cold shot followed by a return to mild weather. We're looking at a fundamental shift in our atmospheric setup. The jet stream configuration responsible for these Arctic invasions appears locked in place for potentially weeks, not just days. Portland, Seattle, and Vancouver could finally see significant mountain snow as this pattern redirects Pacific storm energy. Salt Lake City and Boise, get ready for what could be the snowiest period of your entire winter season. Phoenix and Las Vegas might actually see their first measurable precipitation in months as this atmospheric reorganization takes hold. Now let me share something that's absolutely crucial for everyone watching. Timing is everything with these rapid fire weather systems. If you're planning any travel this weekend, particularly across the Midwest or Great Lakes, you need to monitor conditions hourly. Minneapolis St. Paul International and Chicago O'Hare should prepare for potential delays and cancellations as these systems move through. For those planning to attend any outdoor events this weekend, layer up and have backup plans because conditions can change rapidly. I want to take a moment to address something that's been on my mind throughout this forecast. Here's what makes this entire pattern so remarkable from a long-term perspective. We're transitioning from one of the warmest December-January periods on record to potentially one of the most active winter weather patterns in years. This represents exactly the kind of dramatic atmospheric flip that keeps meteorologists fascinated with weather pattern analysis. The computer models are showing remarkable agreement on the overall pattern, which gives us high confidence in these Arctic invasions. European and American forecast models are both painting similar pictures of sustained cold and active weather through the end of January. But here's where uncertainty still exists and why continuous monitoring becomes absolutely critical. Storm tracks can shift by just 100 to 200 miles and completely change who gets snow versus who stays dry. Temperature gradients will be so sharp that a few degrees difference determines whether you see snow, ice, or just cold rain. This is exactly why I emphasize following professional meteorological sources during complex weather patterns like this. Let me ask you something important. What's your biggest weather concern for the next two weeks? Are you hoping for snow for winter recreation, or are you worried about travel and safety impacts? Drop your honest thoughts in the comments because understanding your concerns helps me tailor future forecasts to what matters most to you. Now, let's dive into the specifics of what each region should expect as these systems unfold. Upper Midwest residents from North Dakota to Minnesota should prepare for the most active winter weather period you've seen this season. We're talking about multiple rounds of snow, with accumulations stacking up significantly by the time all three Arctic systems pass through. Great Lakes region. Your lake effect snow machines are about to receive the perfect atmospheric fuel for sustained heavy snow production. Some areas could see 12 to 18 inches of snow by the end of next week, with isolated locations potentially approaching 24 inches. Ohio Valley and Appalachian regions are positioned for what could be your most significant winter weather of the entire season. The mountainous areas of West Virginia, Pennsylvania, and Virginia could see enhanced snowfall from upslope flow effects. Mid-Atlantic cities, including Richmond, Norfolk and Virginia Beach need to stay alert for potential winter weather surprises. Even coastal areas could see snow flurries or light accumulation if Arctic air penetrates far enough southeast. Southeast residents from Georgia through the Carolinas, this could be your chance to finally see some winter weather magic. While significant accumulation remains unlikely, the possibility exists for light snow or flurries in the highest elevations. Florida, you're not completely off the hook. Hard freeze warnings could extend well into central portions of the state. Agriculture and sensitive vegetation need protection as temperatures could drop into the mid-20s across traditionally mild areas. Now here's something absolutely fascinating about the extended outlook beyond next week. Long-range forecast models suggest this Arctic-favored pattern could persist well into February, meaning this is just the beginning. 
For winter weather enthusiasts who have been waiting all season for significant snow, your patience might finally be rewarded. For those hoping to escape winter's grip, unfortunately, the atmospheric patterns suggest cold and active weather is here to stay. The jet stream positioning that's driving these Arctic invasions shows remarkable persistence in the computer models. This kind of sustained pattern is what creates memorable winters that get talked about for years afterward. Energy companies across the impacted region should prepare for increased heating demand as sustained cold settles in. Transportation departments are already pre-positioning salt and snow removal equipment in anticipation of increased winter weather operations. Schools and businesses in winter weather zones should review their emergency procedures and closure policies. Let me share something that I think will help put this entire pattern into proper perspective. We're witnessing a textbook example of how quickly atmospheric patterns can reorganize and completely alter regional climates. Just three weeks ago, many areas were experiencing near-record warmth and questioning whether winter would ever arrive. Now we're tracking multiple Arctic invasions that could deliver the most active winter weather period in several years. This demonstrates the dynamic nature of our atmosphere and why long-range weather prediction remains one of science's greatest challenges. For meteorologists, patterns like this represent the perfect combination of predictable large-scale features and challenging mesoscale details. Here's what makes me genuinely excited as a professional forecaster. These are the events that test our skills and advance our understanding. Before we wrap up, I want to address some safety considerations that become critical during rapid weather changes. Hypothermia and frostbite risk increase significantly when temperatures drop this quickly and this far below normal. Vulnerable populations, including elderly residents and those without adequate heating, need special attention during extended cold periods. Pet owners should limit outdoor exposure and provide adequate shelter as these Arctic air masses move through. Automobile winterization becomes essential. Check your battery, antifreeze, and keep emergency supplies in your vehicle. Home heating systems that haven't been tested this season should be inspected immediately before the coldest air arrives. Pipe protection becomes critical as sustained freezing temperatures could cause expensive plumbing damage. If you haven't already, now's the time to develop or review your family's winter weather emergency plan. Stock up on non-perishable food, water, flashlights, and batteries in case power outages occur during ice or snow events. Keep your vehicle's gas tank full and consider carrying extra warm clothing and blankets during travel. For those in rural or isolated areas, ensure you have backup heating sources and emergency communication methods. Now, let me share something that I find absolutely remarkable about winter weather forecasting in the modern era. The computer models tracking these Arctic invasions are processing atmospheric data from thousands of observation points worldwide. Satellite imagery allows us to watch these weather systems develop and intensify in real time with unprecedented detail. Despite all this technology, human expertise remains absolutely crucial for interpreting complex patterns like what we're seeing this week. This is exactly why following professional meteorological sources becomes so important during high-impact weather events. Social media weather hype and amateur predictions can create dangerous confusion when accurate information literally saves lives. I want you to be informed but not panicked, prepared but not paralyzed by fear of what these weather systems might bring. The key is staying connected to reliable forecast sources and adjusting your plans based on official warnings and advisories. Here's something I'd love to hear from you in the comments. Which aspect of this winter weather pattern interests you most? Are you fascinated by the atmospheric science, excited about snow possibilities, or concerned about safety and travel impacts? Your feedback helps me understand what resonates with viewers and guides how I approach future weather discussions. The most requested location in today's comments will receive a detailed forecast breakdown in tomorrow's update video. I personally read every comment and respond to as many specific location requests as possible throughout the week. This community engagement is what makes weather forecasting so rewarding, connecting with people whose lives are directly affected by these patterns. As we continue tracking these Arctic invasions over the next several days, expect frequent updates on any significant changes. The atmospheric energy driving these systems is so dynamic that forecast adjustments are likely as we get closer to each event. 
Storm tracks could shift, intensity could change, and timing could vary by several hours in either direction. This uncertainty is normal and expected for complex weather patterns. It's why meteorologists emphasize staying informed rather than relying on a single forecast. If this breakdown helped you understand what's developing, please hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell immediately. Your support helps us reach more people who need reliable weather information during potentially dangerous situations like this. Share this video with anyone in the potential impact zones so they can prepare appropriately for what's coming their way. Winter weather safety depends on community awareness and preparation. Be the person who helps others stay informed and protected. Before you go, take a moment to check on elderly neighbors and family members who might need assistance preparing for extended cold weather. Small acts of community support become incredibly important during significant weather events that affect entire regions. Remember that weather patterns like this remind us of our shared vulnerability and the importance of looking out for one another. As these Arctic invasions unfold over the next week, we'll track every development with the precision and care your safety deserves. This is the kind of atmospheric drama that makes winter fascinating and occasionally dangerous. Respect the power, but don't fear it. Stay informed, stay prepared, and stay connected as we navigate this remarkable winter weather pattern together. The next 7 to 10 days will showcase the incredible power and beauty of our planet's atmospheric systems in action. From frigid Arctic air masses to lake effect snow machines, we're about to witness nature's winter theater at its finest. Whether you're a winter weather enthusiast or someone just trying to stay safe and warm, this pattern has something significant in store for everyone. Thanks for joining me for this comprehensive winter weather breakdown. Drop your location below and I'll see you in tomorrow's critical forecast update.